Hi everyone, this is the fellow passenger speaking. As some of you have noticed, there is an issue with the expression control in the latest version of Ableton. I think I have this occasionally in previous versions, but now it seems pretty consistent. I use the expression control a lot, and it seems like if I close the file and open it again, my expression controls have lost all their mappings. Um, sometimes the mappings actually still work, even though the expression control is blank. Sometimes the parameters seem to be grayed out uh, as if they're mapped to something, but they're not reacting to the expression control. So there's something weird going on. And some people have reached out to me and asked me, is there a workaround or like, is there a way of solving this? I've found a temporary way of doing that, but Ableton, please, uh, if you can, if you could look into this and release a bug where the bug is fixed, um, that would be fantastic. But I'm going to show you for everyone who is stuck. So we got a track here, all, all these are blank. Create a new MIDI track, select all the track other tracks other than your new one, and then delete them. And then you go and undo the deleted tracks. Takes a moment depending on how complicated your file is. Boom, when we click here now, all the mapping is back and it's working again. So that is a quick fix workaround for you. But obviously it's not ideal if you're like playing live and it's, you know, an extra step. Um, so Ableton, hopefully to help you, I just want to show you the system I'm running about this Mac. That's what we want. So I'm on an M1 uh, Mac mini from 2020, uh, 16 gig gram. You probably got all the information you need there. Uh, and I am running this version of Ableton Live. It's uh, it's the Live 11 Suite, 11.2.6, and you got the build number there. Hopefully, that's going to give you a hint, a hint of where to start. So I'm um, looking forward to a bug fix. And for everyone else, I hope this little trick was helpful to you. Thank you.